it's a beautiful morning. I'm at my uh, preserve that's closest to home. So I'm in what I call my neighborhood. Ooh, a bunch of deer, look at them. They just ran into the marsh. That's why I love this place. I rarely uh, take a hike here without seeing some wildlife. It's a beautiful morning. It's nice and cool. This is a nice breeze, which is surprising for uh, this time of year in Florida. Oh, they went down the game trail, so they're gone. On to new things, new trail. See, there's a deer way in the distance there. I'm atop an abandoned um, tree stand that I found that overlooks this marsh. You can see what a beautiful Martian is too. Got a lot of rain. Water's filled up here. You can kind of see it nice from this perspective. It's like climbing a tree. It's a lot easier work on this tree stand. I came across a sundew, carnivorous plant. You can see how it just glistens like dew, but that water on there is actually a sticky substance that traps insects so that the plant can eat them because there's not a lot of nutrients in the swamp um, soil. And that's how they make up for the lack of nutrients by eating insects. And all those little glistening drops that look like dew are actually real sticky, almost like Gorilla Glue type stuff that traps the insects and the plant ingests it. Cool stuff. If you look real closely, there is a small insect that's trapped uh, on the sundew. I don't know how good it'll come out on the um, video with this camera but it's all the way on the toward the bottom left hand side a small gnat or something like that I wonder how many mosquitoes they get and this is why I love to start my day with the crack of dawn in the woods I'm just resting on a nice dry bed of soft pine needles I have a blue sky above me Green pine trees everywhere, swaying in the wind. It's good medicine. Calms you down, relaxes you. It's good for the body, the soul, and the mind. Airboats just came by. Probably hear them on the camera in the distance. This is the end of the trail for me. That's just too deep of a swamp hike for me there. I'd sink in the mud, quicksand, and everything else in there. Like a 1950s safari video or a movie or something like that. Some nice wildflowers. There's a nice purple one. I don't know what type of plant that is. It's kind of cool. I 
As always, make sure you sign in at the trailhead so people know where you are. And if there's a problem, they can look it up and find out who you are and find you if you get lost on the trails. There's an interesting uh, tree frog right there, too. Don't forget to sign.